Welcome to What Is, a series where we aim to answer some of the more complex questions around the 36th edition of the America's Cup. In episode two, we aim to answer just what is the twin skin mainsail. We've turned to our North Sails experts to fill us in. Watch and find out. In the last episode, we explained two key things. What is foiling? And how the America's Cup has always led the way in sailing innovation. This edition of the Cup is where the story of the twin skinned mainsail begins. Here's a fun fact about the twin skinned mainsail. It was actually invented over 90 years ago, in 1927, by Louis Francis Herreshoff, the son of Nathaniel Herreshoff, the famous naval architect who built five winning America's Cup boats back in the 19th century. So, how did a sail, invented in 1927, become a central part of the America's Cup in 2021. Following the Kiwis win in 2017, the boat and sail designers sat around a table and began drafting the Cup's new rules. There was a desire to move away from the solid wings of the last three America's Cups to make the benefits of the technology in the America's Cup more accessible to all sailors. The wings were cool, but you needed loads of people to move them, and there was no trickle-down effect from elite racing to everyday sailing. But still, what is the twin skin mainsail? Don't overthink it, it's exactly what the name says it is. Two mainsails. The design teams figured out that if they make a D-shaped mast, then hang a sail skin off each of the back corners, they could make a really nice, low drag, aerodynamic surface that trimmers could manipulate. As the sails and the boats developed, the designers realized that the twin skin mainsail is actually really versatile. For the majority of teams competing, these sails are all made out of North Sails 3DI. We know what you're thinking. There must be loads of secret squirrel, super techie, magical things going on between the sails. Well, we hate to burst your bubble, but there isn't. It's actually dead air. It is, however, up to the teams if they want to connect the sails at the leech and the top and bottom. It's also up to the teams if they want a boom and if the skins are the same size. And the rest of the rigging? Nothing secret about it. An AC-75 still has a Traveller, Cunningham, running back stays and sheet systems. When sailing, the boats are continuously adapting to what the boat needs, with varying conditions. We know it's a lot to take in, but we hope this gives you a basic understanding of what's happening with the twin skin main and its 90 year history. Stand by for our next episode of What Is. Hit the subscribe button below and make sure to tune into all the North Sales coverage of the 36th America's Cup.